Hey, what's up, guys? Um, so I'm in Newham today because I've got an athletics race, and Jamie's come with me. You alright, Jamie? Mm hmm. Yeah, it's kind of funny. He was saying we spend like what an hour and a half to get here just to race for like 11, 12 seconds. It's, it's, it just seems like really ridiculous. Um, yeah, there's like 32 Team GB athletes that are racing today. And I could be racing um, this guy called Jason Smith. He's like the fastest guy in the Paralympics, like the Usain Bolt version. Oh, he's, so. my hero. he's my hero as well. I sent him a tweet and he replied on Twitter. Um, but yeah, I could be racing him. If I do, I'll get completely demolished. Um, like, legit. I'm okay, hoping to he get... He runs like 10.2. I run 11 seconds. He's white and he can nearly beat And he's white and Irish. <laughs> so it's just... Crazy. Wait, is someone... In the Paralympics ever run under 10 seconds? I don't think so, no. I should. I could be the first one. Yeah, you could be. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna do one race. I should be doing two, but I have to go somewhere at the end of the day. Yeah, Newham's Leisure Centre is such a nice place. They've got like everything. They've got like 3G football courts. Um, rugby pitches, athletics track, swimming. They've got everything. Indoor athletics. Indoor athletics. I just went to stock up on my energy supply. Bought like 10 chocolate bars. Yeah, no hair <laughs> Some Lucas A's, some water, some hula hoops. Give me that burst of energy while I'm running. Should be good. I'm gonna go warm up now. It's got like 40 minutes before my race. Should be good. Anything else you want to say, Jamie? Um, nah. You don't want to say anything? Nah. Cool. Yeah. I'm gonna uh, stop recording now. <laughs> Is that alright with you? Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna press the stop button now. Oh my man, it's still recording. I'm quite tired now, but tell them who you just met. What's his name again? Jason Smith. Jason He's Smith. Usain Bolt of the Paralympics. He's just the world record holder. And I just took a photo of him. I put it on Facebook later. It was so sick. <laughs> I'm just doing some practice strides. I think I'm done, I better get there before I miss my race. <laughs> Why is he recording me? That's my guy. Oh, Jay's come through, 
come from? Um, I just finished racing. Um, I raced against Jason Smith. I know I keep going on about this, especially on Facebook. But it's so sick, um, because he's like the fastest Paralympian in the world. Um, and no one really knows, like, I don't know. Huh? Ever as well. Yeah, ever. Like, he's the world record holder for the whole of the Paralympics. Like, faster than Oscar Pistorius, even though everyone knows him a lot. And, you know, it was just such an honour to race him. It felt so good. And, you know, we talked for ages and he gave me so much advice about athletics, how I could improve and all that stuff. So, um, I put, I'm going to put, like, a, an interview that I had, that I recorded with him on. That's quite cool. I'm kind of dressed in a funky style because I'm going somewhere else now. Some African stuff. I'll probably um, record that as well. Jamie was about to go, but yeah. he had to go somewhere else. Pulled out. He pulled out. <laughs> Africans too funky for you. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely. Yeah, I'm gonna get a train, find somewhere to eat. Where do you wanna go? What do you feel like eating? Anywhere. Anywhere? Anywhere. Anywhere in particular? No. Just anywhere? Just anywhere. What do you feel like having? Just anything. You have to be specific, man. I'm a boss. <laughs> You're like this with everything. I ask you something, and you just like you just generalise it. So, an interesting fact: I did personality test the other day in uh, college, mm. and you tick the boxes, and then it gives you coordinates, and you plot yourself on a graph, and it tells you what your personality should be like. Yeah. And it actually summed me up properly. It said easygoing, relaxed, and all that sort of stuff. Which is just so true. Well, I don't like it. Because it means I have to make all the decisions. Someone was around here, don't they? Oh, my arm hurts so much. Yeah, find somewhere to eat. I feel like having something hot and spicy. <laughs> Maybe chicken. <laughs> As usual. Surprise. Um, yeah, but it's been a good day, you know. Um, it's nice to kind of know that I've evened out the season with 11s. Because last season I was running like high 12s, low 12s. So this season I've been coming in with like high 11s. And it's nice to know that, you know, it's been constant. Because today I ran 11.9. And yeah, hopefully next season it'll be high 11s. Low 11s. Oh! High 11s, low 11s. High 11s, low 11s. So confusing. Low 11s. And yeah, hopefully, you know, with time comes progress. And yeah! You alright? Yeah. <laughs> we just found this, um, this really nice chicken place. They do some pretty cool stuff. I got, like, chicken... Hot spicy chicken wings, burger and chips. What did you get? Chips, onion rings and two chicken burgers. And it's such a bargain as well, isn't it? Mm. £4.50. £4.50. I paid £4.90. It's so sick. And that's bigger than a Big Mac as well, I think. And it's like two of them for £2.60. That's sick. It is. Ugh, this chicken is so spicy. What's up, bro? Uh, you're What's up, bro? How do you feel after that big meal? <laughs> nah, like, it was so cheap, but there was so much, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. And I just feel so bloated. Um, I know the feeling. Huh? I know the feeling. You know the feeling? Yeah. I'm feeling bloated. Yeah. Why is that? So I sort of feel it now. You sort of feel it now? Yeah. Yeah, so what are we doing now? What's the plan? Jumping on the tube. Jumping on the tube. Towards Waterloo. To Waterloo. Then looks like we're going to Kingston or we're going to the train. I don't think I'm going to go to Kingston though. We're not going to Kingston. I'm just going to take the train straight to where I need to go. Because I'm going to be late. So, that's what's going on. I hate train stations because there's so many people and you don't know where you're going. No, but you're like saying it in a negative way. 